If you are one of the relatively few Mainers who have solar panels on your roof, today was a good day to make electricity. That's for sure. But there's a growing trend here in Maine that has people getting solar power without a panel in sight. Now this all ties in because Governor Mills has proclaimed this week Clean Energy Week. News Center Maine's Hannah Yashivi is in Herman tonight with more on this growing trend. Hi Hannah. Chris and Cindy, for sure a lovely afternoon outdoors to bring you this story about solar power. To take advantage of it, you don't even need to install solar panels of your own. Now you can tap into the community solar option. Community solar gives a group of people an opportunity to pool their resources or to come together to share in the output of a larger solar project. Here in Maine, that term is called net energy billing. In 2019, Maine legislators opened the doors wide open to community solar. So under the program, the consumer can make an arrangement to share in or subscribe to a portion of that community solar project. Which is what is happening here in Herman, this new community solar project featuring more than 14,000 solar panels. It's a five megawatt solar farm. Um, it produces five megawatts AC power and sends it out to the grid. Producing enough energy to power about 600 main homeowners, renters, or small businesses. So they can benefit from um, the savings that result from solar energy, and they can also benefit from participating in a program that does help lower our carbon emissions. For a regular household or small business, Rio says those savings are about 15 percent. He's with Ampion Renewable Energy tasked with finding subscribers. Consumers are always paying a fixed and guaranteed discount rate off of these standard offer rates which are set by the utilities. Representative Seth Barry of Bodenham sits on the state's Energy Utilities and Technology Committee. He's all for green energy but remains concerned about the cost. You know we have to make sure that the customers of, of these utilities are not uh, shouldering more of the burden than necessary, make sure that um, none of the players, whether it's the utilities or the developers, are making excessive profits. Part of that policing involves going through the State Public Utilities Commission. Susan Falloon is with the PUC. The consumer's portion of the output of the project is reflected as a kilowatt hour credit on their monthly electric bill. Falloon says right now the PUC has 231 registered net energy billing projects here in Maine, including this one in Herman. These are good programs and they help Mainers and uh, they're going to reduce our energy costs and they're going to contribute in a very positive way to economic growth in the state. Chris and Cindy, if you want to consider taking part in community solar for your house or your small business, Susan Falloon tells me it's important that you verify that the solar company who is marketing to you is legitimate. Ampion, who is in charge of this project, is registered with the PUC. And we have a list of those approved companies on our website and mobile app. Live in Herman, Hannah Yashivi, New Center, Maine.